hey guys welcome back to my channel and in today's video i'm going to be showing you how to cornrow your hair your own hair by yourself so to get started the first thing you want to do is to partition your hair into two equal halves so that way it is easier for you to braid your hair and also try to secure the other side okay so i went ahead to braid the other half off camera but i'm going to be showing you how to do it on this other side on camera so that's what we're going to be doing today so what you want to do is to make sure that your hair is super moisturized especially if your hair lacks moisture my hair is natural and i'll need to soften it up so that way it is easier to manage and to cornrow or weave properly so what i have in the spray bottle is my leave-in conditioner mixed with water and some of my oils to make sure that the detangling process says it's made easy okay so that's what you want to do so let's get started so i'll try by patting this all the way to the back okay and also i'll try to get equal sections all the way to the back hopefully this line comes out straight so your line does not necessarily need to be straight but just try as much as possible to get a straight line that you can work with okay and i would like to partition the hair into medium sizes okay so it is easier for me to braid okay you do not want to have large sizes that way it makes it difficult for you to grab the hair when braiding so i would like to have about 10 braids for today's video take your time to do this and also have a mirror in front of you so it can help so once you've gotten the parts that you want to start braiding on just go ahead to secure the other parts okay and then get right into it so this is our line it came out straight i think <laughs> so we can work with that So to start corn rolling, you want to take a piece of your hair first and then you divide that into three equal halves and you're going to be needing your three fingers you'll be needing your thumb your index finger and your middle finger for the whole corn row process or the braiding process okay so we're going to be looping or twisting each hair strands across each other making sure that we are picking hair from the back so it looks like we are braiding on our scalp okay so it comes out as cornrow and not a braid so i'm gonna have descriptive arrows just to show you guys how it works okay so all you need to do is just try to follow my hand movement so you pinch the right section you send it to the back and then you pinch from the other end so what we are doing here is pinching from both sides basically okay so you pinch from the right you move it to the back and then you pinch from the left and then you move it to the back okay all you want to do is to make sure that you are grabbing hair okay from the back so i'm pretty sure that the visuals are more explanatory so all you need to do is just to follow it closely and with practice you will get it in no time i'm gonna show you guys at least a couple of more times how it is done and make sure to be as descriptive as possible just follow my description and also follow my hand movement So here we have our first corn row done and this is what it is looking like. So we're going to do the same thing to the rest of the hair following the same process. Again, I'm going to grab a piece of the hair and section it into three equal halves and then I'll use the index finger picking one half up and crossing it to the back okay picking up the other half again so we are basically just twisting to the scalp okay making sure that we are taking hair from the back as we are going along so my middle finger is also doing a great job in securing the other half of the hair okay so it's securing both the left and the right section and putting it in place so that they don't interfere with the middle section now if you take a close look you will understand what i am talking about so that's 
that middle finger practically guides you on how you send each hair towards the back as you can see i'm going to leave you guys to watch more of this video and the whole corn roll and braiding process okay so that you are really grasping the idea okay so i believe that with more practice and more of watching this video over and over again you'll be able to conroll your hair by yourself it is actually very very simple to do So I'm just going to go ahead now to oil my hair using my hair cream, okay? So this helps to further lock in moisture. So you can as well add some edge control to your edges if you want to. So guys, this is the complete look and this is how yours should look like once it is complete, okay? So take your time and practice and do this over and over again. You cannot get it at the first time, okay? You cannot get it the first time. You're going to make lots of mistakes. Your hair is going to be loose and all of that. But with continuous practice and watching this video, you're going to be perfect at it, okay? So this is your go-to protective style and you can rock this with your wig okay so you can wear your wig on this and just go about your day and yeah we've come to the end of this video and i hope you guys enjoyed this little tutorial see you guys in my next video bye
Ooh. Mm.